That's great. Why don't you try using it? So is the power on or not? The power for the elevator is activated. Okay. No. Not the worst idea. No, I don't think I'm gonna take those anymore. I think I'll take that though. Oh, it's doing that fucking thing again. Thank you. My god, it's like, it's glitching! Oh man, I'm upset. <laughs> it's giving me free ammo. But I mean, I don't want it. I don't want the free ammo, man. Free ammo's trash. Free ammo's for scrubs. Barry. There's Barry. Jilski. What up, dude? What's good, family? I dropped the cap to my water bottle, never to be found again. Disappeared into the abyss of the carpet. I lost my way. What is that supposed to mean? Let's get going. What? Wow, interesting. Interesting conversation you two are having now. Girl. Did a fine job, Barry. I think you should stay away from Barry, Jill. I hear his wife and two daughters will be in danger if he doesn't do everything I tell him to. You are so cruel. Well, you don't have to worry about it. Because you'll be free from this world very soon. Why do you have to destroy stars? That's the, uh, you know, the intention, man. That's what we were doing, man. We got these dangerous experiments and this stupid accident happened and this disaster can't be made public. That's why having stars about is so inconvenient. Along with these virus monsters, oh man. The language in this game is always so top-notch. I think you misunderstand this poor man, Jill. Me, the monsters you mentioned mean not a thing. He's gonna burn them all with the lab. He's gotta complete his mission as ordered by the umbrella. Under his umbrella. Go up on the ground, Barry, and wait for me. Look at this man silent. Barry. Wow, he put the text. Barry's such a fool. Hey, the text is on top. It should be on the bottom. Hey. He'll be under the control of Umbrella forever. How come Umbrella and you can intimidate him? By taking his family as hostages. Hmm. For his own personal purposes. What a scumbag. That's right. He don't work for Umbrella. If you succeed in developing the world's most powerful biological weapon, what would you do? You must stop this. You're a brave little chicken. But if I were you, I'd give it up. You guys are stupid. You don't understand the value. So what are you gonna do? Give a fucking Billy Mays two-for-one offer on these things or what? Better yet, I'm gonna show you my tyrant. Drops pants. Get in there. Get the fuck in there. Shoot my fucking tyrant. Tyrant virus is a super virus which creates a monster which is much stronger than human beings. Tyrant is the most powerful biological weapon in the world. You don't mean you're experimenting on like real people. Well, come on, man. Who did you think they were? For the sake of an awful creature, all these people exist to be eaten, including you. Click. Ugh. What? 
Don't come this way. Uh... Ah. It can't control what it does. And then it turns into Ninja fucking Turtle. Okay. Yo, the bazooka in this game is glitchy as fucking all hell, man. Yo, Tyrant, you gotta speed up a little, man. There's there's no pressure here, bro. I'm just gonna... Bop! Just gonna... Bop! Oh, no, I'm out of ammo. <laughs> Excuse me. <gasps> Piece of shit. <laughs> Fuck off my screen. Bitch. Oh, Barry's gone. Let's save the game again. Because why not? Oh wait, I could go save my boy Chris. Christicles. Chris-key. God damn it, Jill. Of course I'm alive. I know, Chris. I gotta get you out of here. There you go. Oh, Jill. Sorry for keeping you waiting. So everything's done? Yep, let's get out of here. I'll wait for you by the elevator. Excellent. The triggering system has now been activated. All researchers stand by. Take cover immediately. I unlock all routes for evacuation. That's the Resident Evil 2 version. That's okay. But that's okay. Dun, dun, dun. Uh. Hello? Uh, that's funny, man. Alright, I'll see you in the morning, dude. Later, bro. That's fucking funny. That's fucking funny. Okay. I gotta get out of here. Oh, oopsie daisies. Not the correct elevator? Where do I have to go? Hmm. Oh yeah, that's right. It's this emergency elevator exit thingy over here. Or is it over here? Yeah. Oh, Jill. Sorry for keeping you waiting. So, everything is done. Well, let's go. I will wait. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna save, like, right here, because it's very close and convenient to the end. I'm gonna talk to Barry. Fuck me, oh, Barry, we have to get out of here. Yeah, you think? Let's go. Battery. Got the battery. Gonna put the battery here. Very uh, intuitive game design. Three minutes till explosion. There's three minutes until explosion. Um. <laughs> Ladies first, go Jill. But Chris, come on, let me go to give it a shot. Be a nice guy. I like how every like the the alarm is kind of like matching with the music. Take the flare. Do take the flare. Do it. Shoot the flare in the air. Call down the helicopter from there, and then you get out of there. Uh oh whoa 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 You can at least get a rendition of the tyrant music Fuck I'm having a very hard time with this Still fine. Oh shit. Uh, 
Oh, okay, just use goddamn rocket launcher. <laughs> Not very climatic, but I'll take it. And that's it. I'm the best man I did it. This got me on that RPG Maker hype, man. I need to stop playing RPG Maker games again for the channel. You know, I actually found out that the guy who made Faye, a game I played way back in the day, is releasing a game on Steam in just a, like, like a little close to next May. Nah, I just wanted to say that because it rhymed, but, uh, I think it's coming out in, like, February or something? I'm fucking hyped. Fucking hyped. It's gonna be dope. Almost as dope as this D-Make. Resident Evil D-Make. The end? Okay, yeah. I'll fucks with this, uh, 8-bit rendition of the ending music. It's pretty dope. Let's go. Resident Evil D make alpha version. Good job, goddess. Wow, there he actually credits the entire fucking Capcom staff? What a nerd. Gotta respect it, I guess. And I guess it wouldn't be much of a credit screen without that, right? <clears throat> I wonder if there's anything uh, worth seeing past the creds. This was mad fun. If you got like an hour or two to kill, I highly suggest it. Especially if you know the first Resident Evil like the back of your hand. You can run through this so fast. It's pretty easy. I would love to play like a Resident Evil 2 version of this, for sure. That was so fun. Oh, look at that, two hours and one minute. And I got the special key, find closet. I know where the closet is, dude. 